So as I shared yesterday, every time I wear my smiley Nirvana shirt, I get ridiculous persecution. Now, if I could just speak plainly and honestly, um, <laughs> when I was in eighth grade, I would get picked on a lot, and um, it was um, it was made to my attention that Kurt designed this shirt for me um, to cheer me up. And, and I got it when I was 13 years old and uh, you know I loved it it was so awesome to me um, but now that I'm thinking about this shirt and thinking about the words that are on the back of this shirt um, I think the enemy hates this shirt so much because it's really about the repenting of the wicked okay we are all flowers in the field of God Okay, those who are repenting, those who are repenting or want to repent become baby kittens, do they not? And we all are to love each other, love our brother as ourselves, so therefore we will be baby kissing. And since they're still in the devil's grasps and the devil's domains, they will be considered corporate rock whores, right? Adulterers, as the scriptures say. So wearing these shirts, if you want to stand for the Lord, um, would absolutely be necessary. Really cool. Um, I don't know what Kurt was thinking when he designed this shirt, um, but surely he was probably thinking prophetically. There's, there's no coincidence that these words are prophetic and biblical concepts, um, bringing the wicked into the light. Or maybe bringing, when I was a kid, maybe bringing me into light. I don't know. I don't know. Something to meditate on. But, um, I don't know. You know, the enemy doesn't deserve an inch. Um, you know, if you can get your hand on one of these shirts, I highly recommend wearing them. Um, you know, if you are a servant of Satan wanting to repent and uh, stand for what's right. So, uh, okay, just wanted to share that. Thanks for tuning in. I'll bless you.